Okay, Fight Freaks, it's your boy Big Steve G, the voice of the TitleFight.com, and on the phone with us today is a very special guest, top 10 lightweight contender, Hammer and Hank Lundy. How are you, champ? Hey, I'm good, I'm good, man, living, traveling. <laughs> All right, well, thanks for taking some time out this weekend to talk with us. Hey, no problem, thank y'all. All right. All right, champ, where did you grow up? Oh, uh, I grew up in South Philadelphia. All right, South Philly. Uh, I did read somewhere that you took up boxing after beating up a bully. Can you tell us a little bit about that experience? Oh, man, well, you know, the guy, he was a bully. You know, he used to come up to the school, pick, one, pick on kids. And one day, like, you know, <laughs> one day, like, you know, he was coming out to um, the school yard, and he was going there, and then, you know, he, he bumped me, and he didn't say excuse me. And then, you know, he was on the way going to school, and I said I was going to wait for him. But, you know, I met up with him, you know, when he was outside fighting, and he actually was kicking me. And, you know, I was thinking I had to do something to keep the guy from kicking me. And I threw a punch out to the um, to the right. He looked at him, then I clocked him with the left, and he, he had to knock him out. Kind of just got a rush off of just knocking somebody out and decided you wanted to do it for a living, huh? Yeah, well, you know, I'm not going to fight. I used to always like to fight. So, you know, being in the gym, that was a blessing in the sky. So how did you get the name Hammer and Hank? Uh, one of my coaches, you know, the amateurs, you know, I used to travel all around, and they called me the um, Hammer, and then, you know, they say, well, he hammered, so they put it together, Hammer and Hank. And then, you know, my nickname is Hank, so it is a perfect nickname. So you had a pretty good amateur record of 65-5. and five. Uh, Did you ever consider trying for the Olympics in 2004, or were you still just coming up? Um, if I'd have beaten him, I'd have went on to fight female fights, which I knew I would have won, and I'd have been considered to be number one. And I would have rain, you know, hold everything down. I could have, I could have made the team, but you know, I was fed up with the Olympic boxing scoring, and I decided to turn pro. Okay, did you witness any gym wars while training in Philly, and have you ever been involved in any? coming in there, you know, trying to prove they, they toughness or just saying they've been in a ring with Hammer and Hank. You know, I've been in a couple growing up, but now, you know, as I'm getting older, you know, we pick out work and, you know, it's all about getting work and learning from it, not just going in there banging each other away. And that's what a lot of Philly fighters are doing today, is, you know, coming together and, you know, just learning to work with each other instead of, you know, just banging on each other. Okay, champ, you're coming off of a close loss uh, to Bray Beltron last week. What are some of the things you felt you could have done better in that fight? Well, you know, first and foremost, you know, um, it was a good fight not to get nothing for Beltron. After, after the fight, Beltron, he stated that I won the fight, but you know how it goes sometimes. But, you know, um, in that fight, you know, the weight killed me, you know. I, I'm a professional, so I really struggled, you know, trying to make that actually walk 35. But, you know, at the end of the day, I knew after that fight, I definitely had to move up. I've been... Oh, 135 down for like five years. So, um, you know, my body has grown, and, you know, I definitely knew it was time to move up and wait. But, you know, in that fight, like, I, I fight the best, you know, the toughest, and I don't run from nobody. And that, that fight, you know, I really I, I really didn't learn that much, but, you know, I, what I could have did more was, you know, utilize my jab, like I was doing, looking for, and, you know, just stand off the ropes, the ropes but, you know, and that fight, I was drained, so everything I did in there, I had to do. Okay. Well, we didn't get to see a post-fight interview. Um, however, your expression showed you seemed to be okay with the decision, and you show great respect to Beltron. Uh, did you agree with the final decision? No, 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 I didn't. Like, you know, when I got to the dressing room, I um, put my um, promoter to the side, and I, and I told him, like, you know, I want to fight. Like, I seen him when he was some strange out there. He but, you know, he didn't know what to do. He was just like, you know, I'm going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you know, I'm not going to fight you. Like, you
and defeat and you appear to be very humble champ.